Hello everyone, I'm Dennis Wang. It's been one month after my in-depth test and review for Mini 8KS and I never do this kind of video before because I reserved it specially for the stuff that I'm going to tell you about my experience after using Mini 8KS for one month. If you guys notice, there are several tutorial videos after that. I need to show a failed print example in my video, but everything printed on Mini 8KS will not fail and all those failed printed models are printed on another printer so i know i might sound like a shield but here's a screenshot from another mini 8ks user and my conversation with him Now look at this first test print result. If you print a suction cup, you could see the build plate etching at the bottom that this is a proof that I oriented straight like this and usually it will burst up like this. But this is my very first print that I used Mini AKS for on the tutorial video. So you could see the build plate edge on Mini 8KS. So this is a proof that I oriented straight to be fail, but it will not fail at all. So I think I have to print it again. There you could see the mark of the build plate etching on the bottom of the models. So I print it again. A thinner model here in the hope that it will burst open but turns out it will not burst open at all compared to the result on another printer and I'm sure you guys have seen this very bad print result because of suction cup from incorrect drain hole placement this is printed on another printer and here the result on Mini 8KS. It should have the same result with this, but somehow the print result is just very good. No bad print line as, at all, and it is just very smooth. See, here's side by side comparison. On the left, Mini 8KS, on the right, on another printer. And this is the last model that I'm going to show you. You could see how bad the lines is and I can feel the layer shift. And this is on Mini 8KS. Very smooth, clean and I do not feel any lines at all. But in full honesty, I could see a a slight color change from uh, from this line here there is a slight color change let me get it more close up mm, here you can see there's a slight color change from this area here under the drain hole or fan hole if you like <laughs> Uh, you can see the slight color change from here to here but the surface is very smooth no shifting lines at all I do not see any bad print lines at all just a uh, some somehow it is a color change but the result the surface is very smooth I'm sure you guys remember that there is a bad print lines on the steering wheel models that I printed on Mini 8KS but that is because I intentionally bumped the printer to see how well the print result but if you do not bump the printer at all I guess this is the result that you will get now this is very hard for me to say and I almost never say this at all but I think 
Frozen Sonic Mini 8K S is the best printer that I encounter as of today. So, see you guys in the next video and thank you for watching.